and then you guys loading the bases and Rizzo with a two-out, two-run single. Yeah, um, I was fired up. I mean, I was kind of kicking myself for the pitch I threw Suzuki there. Just the slider got got up on me a little bit and gave him an opportunity to, to get the barrel to it. Um, so I was pretty sick about that. Um, but, yeah, our guys pressured their reliever to, to throw strikes, and we were patient. We waited him out, and then Rizzo coming up with a huge hit there. It just felt like one of those nights where we were going to make it happen. Um, but, you know, glad, glad that we were able to grind that out there in the eighth. Your thoughts on sweeping the doubleheader and sweeping the series? Yeah, it's hard to win two um, in the same day, so I'll, I'll definitely take it. Uh, you know, we're playing well, and we can win in a lot of different ways, pitching, defense, hitting. Uh, our bullpen's nasty, so, um, you know, we've kind of showcased a lot of different things we can do, and I thought today was kind of the same. Strong starting pitching, good defense, timely hitting. Uh, it was definitely a good day. When you got the ballpark today, the weather report did not look like this game was even going to happen. Can you just talk me through sort of what the lead up to first pitch was like for you? Yeah, um, I was looking at the radar all day. Um, I played in the NL Central for a while, so I've dealt with rain and rainouts and delays and all that. So, um, yeah, early in the day, the, the radar wasn't looking good, and we were even kind of talking, you know, with the pitching coach and stuff about. Um, you know, if we get rained out tonight, what day would I prefer pitching and stuff like that? Um, but obviously, I had to stay ready and prepared. Uh, and then towards the middle of the day, the radar cleared up, and I came to the park and knew that we were going to play. So, um, yeah, it's definitely different. Doubleheader already made it different, and the threat of rain made it different, the rain delay and stuff. But glad we could get it in. It seemed like you kind of tweaked your ankle a little bit running to first base there in that final inning. How is that now? Are you at all concerned over it? Yeah, it's good. I'm not concerned about it. I just kind of got like a zinger. Um, you know, I hit the base pretty hard and like twisted my foot a little bit. Um, so the foot feels super stable and strong, but it's still one of those things like it doesn't feel completely normal, um, like my left ankle. So I felt fine getting over there and then just hit the base pretty hard because I wanted that out pretty bad. Um, so just kind of shot like a little zinger up my leg and then completely fine now. Yeah, uh, kind of the the opposite because of the score of the game. Uh, I was kind of telling myself like, no matter what, don't make a mistake in the middle to these guys. Um, let's let's pitch to the edges. Let's keep making our pitches. Um, you know, I've never been in that situation in the eighth inning before or anything, or even the seventh. But the fact that the game was so close, and obviously for us, like winning really matters here. So I was really not pitching to preserve a perfect game or a no hitter. I was pitching to win. So uh, definitely didn't want to walk guys, but also didn't want to make a mistake in the middle to any of those guys. I was okay uh, staying away from the slug. If I had to give up a single or if I had to walk a guy, I was willing to do it.